Hi there, Ag from Swat Arm London here and today we've got a four bedroom home to see in East London. Now specifically we are in Poplar. We've got a Poplar DLR station only about a six minute walk away and in the other direction we have All Saints DLR. Now it's a very residential area, we'll see we have a few flats right around in this immediate vicinity. However as we move towards the stations we'll have lots more options when it comes to shopping and restaurants. So with that said we're going to be seeing all four rooms so let's go ahead and see them. So here's outside of the front door. We actually do have this door here, however, the door that will be in use will be this door here that leads through to the kitchen. So now, as we come through the front, we've got the kitchen and the kitchen countertop is going to be along this whole right wall and will also include all of the appliances necessary. So first thing, we've got the washing machine right above that will have the sink, fridge and freezer, unit is going to be down below. On top we can see we've got the kettle, toaster, stove, as well as the oven underneath that. Up above, plenty of space for any kitchenware and cutlery, pots and pans or food you need to store. And then here at the end we've got the microwave. So a very spacious kitchen. We also do have a dining table. So that's going to be great. So we'll have the garden through here. So we can see we've got the table down here. And if we look out here to the left, we also do have access to the garage. And in the rear of the home, look like this and the next we'll go and see bedroom number one so we saw outside we've got the first toilet of the home and then around the corner we'll have bedroom number one. So in this room we've got a double bed here in the center. An abundance of storage we can see that with the chest of drawers by the bed. And we've got two standalone wardrobes across from each other and then a third is going to be along this wall. So now the window you can see that overlooks the front door corridor area where we saw from the front entrance. And then the window outside here going to be that of the garden. So now we'll head upstairs and see the rest of the home. So at the top of the stairs we have the three bedrooms here in the corridor and then the second toilet here to the left. So we'll start here in the bathroom. See we've got a tiled floor there, it's gleaming. Bathtub in front, sink and radiator here to the right. We've got the window for some extra sunlight. And you can see we've got a few hooks behind the door. So we'll just quickly see the other bathroom next. Or toilet. We've got a sink behind there as well. So here we've got a double bed in this room, bedroom number two. Window that overlooks the garden. The radiator down below. And you can see we've got large storage with the standalone wardrobe right by the door. So next. Bedroom number three. So in this room, again we'll have a double bed. The windows overlook the garden so we'll get a similar view. And this time we'll have built-in storage. So let's 
just get one last view from this corner over here. And see bedroom four, finally. And then finally we'll have room number four. So we've got a single bed in here and then a window that overlooks the street. So that has been it for this home. For more information, make sure to check out spotone.com. Until next time, bye-bye.